Greetings Dover Keen, welcome to Platform Play 2. My name's Ian Higton, of course. Who else would it be? And uh, today's live stream is part two of my Skyrim Remastered PS4 gameplay um, series. You might be wondering to yourselves, but Ian, what's happened to uh, part one? Well, part one was done about a month ago now on Eurogamer. Um, I'm just searching for that video now on the... Uh, on the Eurogame YouTube channel, so I can add a link to that in the description. I'll also be making a playlist um, at some point, probably after this stream, just to so part one and part two are together. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be carrying on from exactly where I left off on that Eurogamer stream. And I, do you know what? Um, I cannot even remember. What my character was called, I have a feeling it was either called Colin or Butts or a mixture of the two. Uh, but I do know that you guys and girls were helping me create my character uh, just like I did in my Fallout 4 livestream series. Uh, hopefully you saw that. Every time I level up I basically get you guys to spam a, uh, a comment or you know a, a perk in the comments and then I look down and I pick at random what perk it is. Now already this has kind of backfired on me uh, because you guys have like turned my character into some kind of fire mage and uh, I've always played Skyrim or Elder Scrolls games as tanks with big swords and maces so uh, I've never played through as a mage before so this should be kind of interesting. Uh, part one is here. I'm just putting that link in the uh, description just in case you haven't seen part one that was done on Eurogamer. Uh, that was done one month ago, yes, and there's three hours of that, that's from the very beginning. But this will be com this will be continuing on. Uh, what I need to do is find my way to the top of the hill and go and talk, uh, top of the mountain, and go and talk to the grey beards, is that what they're called? The some kind of crazy uh, beard guys, I think they're they're called. So we're going to go and chat to them. Um, that's right. So that is saved. If you're on watch page. Alright, we're ready to go. I think I'm sorted. I just need to put my headphones on and do some quick hellos to Mr. Snake Cake, Alex Magoo, Emma Harkham, uh, Stroyer, Serial Knight, Red Cap. Let's turn that volume down a bit. Uh, Emma Harkham, I've said James Bravery. Very good. The very good guys here. Bitgamer. Ollie Lundmark as well as uh, Brendan Quinn, Stephen Reeves, oh, who's that? A horizontally challenged orangutan and everyone else who's watching. Right, so, the mission I need to do, find the Red Guard woman, retrieve no bane. Uh, the way of the voice, yeah, the Greybeards have summoned me to their monastery on a high Hrothgar on the slopes of the throat of the world. They seem to have learned of a mysterious power that I gained when I killed the dragon outside White Run. So we're going to the uh, Greybeards. Now, unfortunately, uh, I went the wrong way at the end of the Eurogamer stream. Instead of, like, I, instead of going from, like, here up to here to Hrygothra, I decided to walk all the way around the base of the mountain like an idiot. So I'm going to fast travel. I don't know if I can fast travel there because I've not. Can I fast travel? What's that? The golden, golden rock, the ritual stone. Fast travel there, fast travel. I, ooh, no, I can fast travel to there. I can't fast travel to High Hrothra. I'll fast travel to the Ritual Stone. No, it took me a bit closer anyway. Uh, hello to CRS8009. Magical Midge is here. So Steve Scodes, all the way from New York, New York. Biagio Ruggiero. <laughs> Biagio Ruggiero. Ruggiero? Ruggiero. Biagio Ruggiero. Question for the group Has anyone bought the remaster? This is the remaster that I'm playing on the PlayStation 4, uh, just in case you're wondering. Uh, Wingsuit Zero and Lassus are here as well. Hello everybody, welcome to my playthrough of Skyrim. Right, so we need to get up there. Um, I'm just wondering if there is a... Like, I can't remember how to get up there. 
So we might just have to walk straight up the hill and see. I, I'm, I'm almost positive there's a path that I have missed. But it's been a m <laughs> it's been a month since I last played this, so I, I am uh, I'm I'm lost. I don't know. Where I'm going to look at my fire mage. At least my f like it's winter here in Skyrim. It's cold. At least my fire mage keeping his hands hands warm. So my fire mage is a cat. The cat was uh, the cat was a suggestion from the community. And what is the cat's name? Uh, no. Uh, no. I don't know how. I don't even know how to find out my cat's name. I am that much out of practice with Skyrim. I forgot all the buttons. That jumps. Excellent. Hey, still life. And a uh, red cut. Yeah, frames per second. The frame rate on this game is not brilliant. To be fair, I wasn't like that impressed with this remaster. It doesn't seem to have done much. Um, it doesn't seem to have done much. Like it's ma it's improved some bits and pieces, but you can probably. If you have this on the PC, you could probably install some mods and have a much better experience, to be honest. And this is mainly just to get it on the next-gen consoles and include it as like a Game of the Year edition with loads of DLCs attached. Which is fair play. I mean, it's, a good, it's, it's good that people who didn't have the game before get to play it. I presume I'm going the wrong way again. See if we can off-road it. Can I climb this? How the hell? There must be an easy way to get to high. <laughs> oh, that one's too steep. Man, what a rubbish, weak-legged wizard! I don't want to end up walking around the base of the mountain again. Oh well. So where am I? I'm there. My current location is there, so hopefully I'll be able to go right around and up like that. That's what I'm hoping. It looks like that it looks like it's going back like leading me back down again. Which is not what I wanna do. Goats! <laughs> Action kill cam on that deadly goat there. Wow, I leveled up. Um, so yeah, uh, with leveling up, uh, you guys got to first of all, you got to choose whether I level up magicka health or stamina, and then uh, destruction, restoration, alterate, whatever, one of those things as well. I don't think I can cancel that. Um, unfortunately, uh, stamina is quite. <laughs> I'm gonna. Uh, okay, I'm gonna do magicka now. You guys need to shout out a perk for me to increase. Let me know what perk I should put on, and then I will. I will load it back up and do that. I, I will add that perk. So, what perk should I give my character? Spam your suggestions in the comments below, and I shall get around to adding that in a second. This is just leading me back down again. Wow! How the fuck do you get up the top of this mountain? Nonsense. La, 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 la. Some kind of cave here. Maybe I'll just screw off my mission and. See if I can get in this cave. Oh, it's a bit too high. I don't think I'm going to be able to get in it. Screw you, goat! 
Destruction is pretty good if you're going for mage, says Magical Midge. Alright. Destruction. So I've already got Novice Destruction. And Destruction Dual Casting. So... Should I do... Everyone's saying destruction, so let's Apprentice Destruction Cast Apprentice Level Destruction spells for half magicka. More destruction spells. I guess I'll go for apprentice destruction. That'll do. Can I? No? What's going on here? Why can't I... Well, I've not played this for a while. Skills. Perks to increase one. What am I doing wrong? Why can't I increase any perks? Oh, you need to be leveled. Ah, oh, right, okay. I need to be level 25. Where does it say that? Uh, oh, requires 30, requires 40, requires 50. Requi okay, alright, so I need to shoot some more things. Alright, is there a different perk I can do then? My destruction level isn't high enough. Right. Okay. Cool. Right. Slowly getting it. Right. Yeah. This is taking me well away from where I need to be. <clears throat> How do we get up there then? Because now I'm all the way over here again. It looks like that's the path around there. Chill Furrow Farm is where I went to before. <laughs> Novice Smithing says Biagio Ruggiero. Riario. Okay. I'll stick it in that. If uh, if I can, smithing. I don't think I'm ever going to use smithing. I'm never going to use smithing. There we go. Now where the fuck did I just put myself to? So my mission I had to go to Chilfurrow Farm before. God knows how you get up there. Smithing is the best, says Lassus. Oh, we'll see about that. Battleborn farm discovered. Battleborn, eh? So that's the up top of there I need to go. But how? But how? There doesn't seem to be a 
a good route up. <laughs> There's like a bear cave somewhere around here. Let's go and fight some bears in the bear cave. Or something. Get some action going, because I have a feeling I'm never going to be able to find my way up this mountain. Ever. Forever, ever, forever, ever. Now ain't this a surprise? Oh hi. This is about it. <laughs> yeah, that's what you get for charging at me, trying to mace me. Note to Rodolph. Rodolph the red-nosed reindeer had a very spelling mistake name. Right, let's have a look. Oh, I'm called Olaf von Buttminster. That was my name because I'm a direct descendant of um, of Henry J. Buttminster. Well, no, Henry J. Buttminster is a descendant of Olaf von Buttminster. Uh, Henry J. Buttminster was my character in Fallout. Right, weapons. Uh, books, keys. Let a note to Rodolph. You're a little stunned. Try my patience. I know my uncle has issues, but he is our watchman and you will respect him. No more sneaking in and out. No more games with his ledger or nails in his chair. One more joke and you'll see how funny a day in a cage can be. Nice, nails in the chair. Lol jokes. Alright. It's an archer somewhere. Where are you watching me from? Oh, up there. Double fisting! Well, yeah. Wow, I just... toasted that guy. What a way to die. Can I... Set fire to him more. Make a nice little bonfire. Man fire. All the cheese! Some good cheese. Let's try and lock in this chest. Oh. Oh. Ew. What's in the chest? Gold! Healing! Silver. Excellent. Gold, healing, and silver. Sick burn there, Ian says Stroyer. Nice. Uh, he's doing the platoon death pose, says Stroyer. Indeed. He is doing the platoon death pose. Yeah. All right. One more for luck. Let's go inside this cave and see what we can find in here. Hope everyone's having a lovely Monday. I am now on my fourth day off work for Christmas, not counting the weekends. If I count Saturday and Sunday. Then it's the sixth. Rodolph? That you? It's me, Rodolph, the red nosed reindeer. Yes. Boss was looking for you, said he'd be up at the summit. Better not keep him waiting. Okay, I pretended that I was Rodolph, the red nosed reindeer. Read Ulfa's book. Wait a minute. Ulfa's a blind man. Oh, well, there we go, yes. There's nothing in his book, lol. Stole a blind man's book. That's pretty fucking low. <laughs> Well, that's pr that's probably more low than what I'm just about to do, which is set fire to a blind man <laughs> from behind. Just ultra ultra arsy movie and well, welly welly. Perhaps I should feel guilty about that. I don't. How do you go stealth? Not like that. I like that. Oh, mage v mage. I got him though. Uh, a gold, two lockpick. My fire skills are becoming stone frostbite. Nice. My fire skills are becoming quite hardcore, I think. He's, unless he's... 
these bandits are pretty weak. I mean, it doesn't surprise me that they're weak to fire, to be fair. Garnet. This is what I did on my last Skyrim uh, playthrough. Never actually completed Skyrim, but I have played a lot of it. And uh, I basically just stole all the gems and the money and silver and stuff. And then had like a a big room in my house in White Run or wherever it was uh, that I just dedicated to keeping jewelry and read an explorer's guide to Skyrim map updated eh to read it's worth having a quick look at the books in case uh, you get one that improves your skills search chest I have to work f for four hours today says Steve Scodes why you amethyst and money worky worky that's not nice, Ian, you utter shit, says Lassus. Emma Harkin says, oh my god. Redcap says, poor guy, and has put a sad face emoji. Hey, it's Monday. If you can't set fire to a, a digital blind man on a Monday, when can you do it, huh? Huh? Mm. Never, that's when. Ruined books. Dagger. Purse. Nice Skyrim helmet. Stealthy, stealthy, sneaky, sneaky. No! I mean, yes. Dead bandits. Double dead bandits. We've got this archer up here. Amount of magic. Uh, got some gold. I love gold! And more gold and lockpick. Not 100% sure unlocking that would be a good idea. What you going to do? Well, I'm going to set you on fire for a start. And then I'm going to loot your still smoking corpse for your money and your seared slaughter fish. That looks like an angry wolf, right? If I let this wolf out, it's going to eat me, right? Friend! Friend! Ah, not friend! Uh, I've contracted rock joy. Why would you do this to me, dog? I set you free! And now you've vanished. What? Oh! Well, I've contracted rock joint. Brilliant. I don't know what that means, but... Hopefully... It's curable. I don't know how to tell. Don't know how to tell. Don't know. But climb up you sorry, I'm trying to read comments and navigate a thin winding pass is not that easy. Anything in the wardrobe? Just some shoes. Who wants shoes? Not I! I'm after gold and jewels. And angry wolves. It was me! Fuck. There we go, destruction's increased to level 25. So I can do destruction next time. Hey ow! Me. Yeah, you try you can try shooting them arrows at me. I'm too good at dodging. Hadouken! Alright, let's hope his body doesn't Oh. 
Well, there'll be no looting from Turduk and whatever his name is. When did it, where did it go? Okay, I don't want to go down there. Well, that's gone forever. Brilliant. Uh, at least there's a chest we can search. 61 gold, potion of the night. Banded iron armor. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it anyway. Um, a big iron sword. Iron great sword. Ian, great Ian. Right, where did his body go? Oh, there it is. Uh, he had uh, some gold. Havajaj's journal. Let's read Havajaj's journal. Oh, no. Oh, no. Items. Books. Alright, I've got to, Sorry, I've just got to go and answer the door. Sorry! Hi, I'm back. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you pass the time by reading that lovely book. Uh, sorry, the last of my Christmas presents have uh, arrived. This evening, um, it's going to be spent watching Die Hard and wrapping Christmas presents. That's that's my plan for tonight. So, uh, what's this saying? Something about how I don't really care about how uh, okay. Whereabouts am I on the map? I am... Ugh. I'm sir. I still need to get up the mountain. Uh, zoom, zoom, zoom. So let's try getting up from Ivarstead this time. It wasn't Santa No Lassus. <coughs> it was Amazon. <laughs> Who <laughs> is basically Santa for uh, lazy people like me who can't be bothered to go out to the shops and do shopping. I did actually go out and do Christmas shopping on the Saturday, but there was a couple of gifts I, for people that I couldn't find that I needed. And uh, Amazon Santa came and sorted that out for me. Right. This way. I know your sights are set beyond this town, but for now, while you're under our roof, I need you to pitch in a little more. She looks grumpy. Yes, mother. Whoa! Hope you know what you're doing with those flames there. Yes, I'm b keeping my hands warm. Uh, tell me, uh, can you tell me anything about high... <laughs> the Greybeards are a strange bunch. They are. I heard they live their entire life without uttering a single word. Can you even imagine? I cannot imagine. The Greybeards are Shut up. I heard they live there in Fast Red. What a stupid name. Fast Red. I'm gonna call her Slow Blue from now on. Here's the way up, look. This is where I missed last time. I am. Wait, what? Who's Clement? Just not ready to make the path to hide off guard. The path isn't safe. Aren't the Greybeards expecting some supplies? Honestly, I'm not certain. I've yet to be allowed into the monastery. Hi. Perhaps one day. I'll help. I wish I could make my deliveries more often, but the road's getting dangerous. I think I can offer Passing you a solution. Way to High Hrothgar, 
About to make a delivery up there myself. What types of deliveries do you make to high force? Mostly oh. food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Uh, and in return? Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. Ah, uh, I could do it for you. Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Here, take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. Be careful of oh, did I miss seven thousand steps indeed. Next time they need to build it closer to the ground. So, he was saying the frame rate's a bit choppy, but that's just the game. Mm, it does look a bit jerky, doesn't it? Weird. It looks fine on my on my capture monitor uh, and the console, but on YouTube it looks a little bit a little bit jerky. What if I? Oh, 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 oh. That looks fine. I don't know. I think it might be. I think it might be YouTube causing uh, the frame rate to be a little bit. Um, a little bit juddery. Seems fine for my webcam. I don't know. Oh well. Apologies if it's a little bit choppy, but um, that seems to be something beyond my control. Uh, emblem one, before the birth of men, the dragon, blah, blah, blah. Right, let's make our way up anyway. And we shall see what we can see up at the top of the tower. Sometimes when the frame rates are a bit weird on YouTube streams. Um, but not on, uh, like my end. Normally the processed videos are fine. <clears throat> Did I... Did I take the deliveries up for that guy? I got real sidetracked then. I don't know whether I took deliveries for this guy up the mountain. I don't care now. Fuck it. Those guys are going to go... The Greybeards are going hungry. Um, they are going to go hungry. What's this here? It's a vicious goat! We must kill it! No, I'm not going to kill any more goats. I'm going to leave the goats alone now. Um, uh, looks alright, I guess. Oh, still a bit jerky game-wise, but so apologies if uh, if if the frame rate's a bit low during this stream. I can't do anything about it. We got 41 people watching right now. Hello, welcome to the stream. Who's this? Baddy or Goody? Keep an eye out for wolves. Hello. You're headed up the path Barknor. 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 Don't go setting the place on fire, okay? Did you hear that Greybeard's called Doverkeen? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. Uh, do you visit the Greybeards? Please the kill the goats, says Lazarus. They have cheese and it ups but your destruction I never go skill. That high up the path anyway. 
Some folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials, but not to make conversation. Oh. I. I'm going to set fire to your goat. Hadouken! <laughs> Poor goat. Doesn't have any cheese. It's got two silver rings on it somehow. Hmm. Emblem 2. Alright, up we go. Further on. Upwards to the highest loft area. It's a lovely day for a walk up as well. Ah, look at you, Wolfie. Got mullered. It's a lovely day for a walk up a mountain. Search the goat. Nothing good on the goat. No rings on this goat. That was a, the last one. Was a fashion goat. The uh, it was the uh, the native Skyrim fashion goat. Uh, you only find them in the mountains of Skyrim. Normally they'll wear a piece of jewellery or two. Um, sometimes a lovely silk dress, maybe a, a hat, fancy hat with some feathers in. Basically, the fashion goats um, of Skyrim, you can never be sure what they look like because obviously fashion's always changing and the fashion goats of, of Skyrim are normally ahead of the curve. So whatever the fashion goats of Skyrim are wearing is normally uh, what comes into fashion couple of weeks later they're uh, they're definitely the uh, the hipsters of the goat world because they wore these fashionable items before they were cool basically they made them cool well wow, it does look really bad on the stream doesn't it um, Give me two secs. I'm just gonna restart the stream and um, uh, see if that fixes it. See if that fixes the frame rate. So I will be uh, just wait there for a second. I will be right back. Loopy doopy doo. So, will that have made things better or worse? Better. Or worse, who knows? Uh, oh, it might have made things better. Let's have a look. Spinny roundy, spinny roundy. Oh, so maybe it was my computer. Well, it seems to look alright now. <clears throat> so, yeah, there we go. Right, back on track. Apologies for the. Uh, the dodgy frame rate earlier wasn't wasn't YouTube after all. It was uh, in fact my computer being a douche. We're back back to uh, back to prime frame rate. Yeah, still the frame rate isn't brilliant in this game. It's definitely not 60 frames per second. But hey oh. What can you do? Hello. Careful with that fire. Oh. Who are you? Just a pilgrim. I'd prefer to leave it at that if you don't mind. Oh, okay. What are you doing? Walking the steps. Oh. Meditating on the emblems. Wow. I make this trip every few years. Sounds thrilling. Not much to do in uh, Skyrim, really. Right, they then. don't have like they don't have like PlayStations or Xboxes. So, what are you going to do to keep yourself entertained? Well, uh, climb up a mountain and squat in the snow and meditate. Pfft. Sounds rubbish. Glad I didn't grow up in Skyrim. Definitely um, think that 2017 is the year that 
<laughs> Upgrade my PC. What the f is this? It's a frost troll. It's a frost troll. It's a frost troll. It's a frost troll, and he's tough as fuck. Ow, that really hurt. Fuck, run away. Uh... Maybe this pilgrim will help me. Help me, pilgrim. Oh, run away. Where's that pilgrim gone? What's my... Troll. No, don't run away. Shit. Frost troll. Oh. He's a tough guy. Right, run away from the frost troll. <clears throat> Turns out fire versus frost troll ain't too good. I haven't saved for ages, Mr. Snakecake. You should know me, I don't do saves. Probably should do, but... Frost Troll! Ah! Shit! He is a tough guy! Ooh. What? They constantly heal? Well, in that case, run away! Uh oh. Yeah. If they constantly heal, then perhaps it's best to to wait and uh, take on frost trolls when I'm less of a weakling. Who is that lady that ran away to Sarambe's brother? Just a pilgrim, meditating. Still after me. Jesus Christ. He wants to bite my face off. Right. I managed to avoid it. I ran away. Got any scrolls, says Biagio Ruggiero. Um, do I? Maybe. Scrolls. I've got Scroll of Fireball to Scroll of Mayhem. Uh, he won't be bothering me once we get up to the Greybeard's hoose <clears throat> for some greybearding. Quite a walk, isn't it? They did say it was like 7,000 steps or something. Aha! Here we go. This looks like a mighty erection. In the middle of nowhere. This is the place we needed. Hi, Hrothgarg! Search chest, empty. Did... So I have no idea if the guy gave me some stuff to put in here. Bud? So I'm not going to. I'm gonna st if he did give me some stuff, I'm stealing it. Wait, what was that? Potion of minor stamina. Yoink. I'm a wizard and a thief. I'm a wizard, I'm a thiefer. Mm. Hello, you. So, a dragonborn appears. Yes, he does. In the turning of the age. A turning of age. I'm answering your summons. We will see if you truly have the gift. Okay. Show us, Dragonborn. 
Let us taste of your voice. Okay. Demonstrate your unrelenting force shout. Do not be afraid. Your shout will not harm us. It's just a mile of breath. Does that work? Shout for us, Dragonborn. Oh. Then we may I gotta do it shouting shout on you. Us, oh. Let us taste of your voice. Alright, have some shout. Dragonborn, it is you. It is me. Welcome to High Hrothgar. Hey, thank you. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Angir Greybeards. Oh, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? Um, I want to find out what it means to be the Dragonborn, or I'm answering your summons. No, no we are here to guide you in that pursuit, just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. Sweet. Does that mean I'm not the only Dragonborn? You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. No. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. Well, uh, I'm answering those. What is this place? Oh, no, fuck it. I'm ready to learn. I don't you care. have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But... Do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum. A thum? Okay. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. Oh, super willing to learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Okay. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. Ooh. All shouts are made up of three words of power. Right. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. I like shouting. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting force. Oh. Ro means balance, <coughs> dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Ro. Oh. What? What are you doing? What the f Well, there we go. I learned a new word. But learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice. Ha! Well, that is how the rest of us learn and shout. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part Seen of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of Ro. Okay. Ro, ooh, Ro, ooh, ooh. I'm absorbing his powers. He's got a weird face, that guy, hasn't he? Okay, demonstrate your unrelenting force Use shout. Your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Okay. Force roll. How's that? You look impressed, you weird faced loon. Well done. Again. Again. Use the boots. Nice. Shout, shout, let it all out, says Emma Harkham. <laughs> These are the shouts I could do right, without. Okay. Once more. Okay, once more. Let's do this. And hard. Stukin. There we go. That was pretty easy. Impressive. I'm not going to lie. Your thumb is precise. Thanks. So is your thumb. Dragonborn. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. 
follow Master Bori. Master Bori. Which one's Master Bori? Oh, there he is. Following you, Master Bori. I booked uh, booked tickets to go and see uh, Star Wars Rogue One for the second time uh, today. I'm not seeing it today. I'm seeing it on Wednesday. Going to uh, gonna go with my mum to see it because she's a big Star Wars fan um, and has not seen it yet. So uh, I'm gonna go watch it with my mum and uh, I'm gonna spoil it all for her all the way through. Just before things happen, I'm gonna I'm gonna say, guess what happens next? It's gonna be awesome. She's gonna love it. Where you going, my friend? Where you going? Oh my god, Lassus, that's gross. Wood. Okay. Wood. Well, I'm not going to lie. These shouts are all pretty rubbish. Word of power learned. Hulkwind. Hulkwind sprint. Okay. Gift me, baby. Oh. Ian, are you going to stream Dead Rising? Says CRS 8009. It didn't get very great reviews, and I've never, no, I've never completed any of the Dead Rising games. I've had them all before, but I get bored of them like after about halfway. So I don't think I'll buy it. To be honest. Whoa! Holy shit, dude! Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind spell to pass through before it closes. Okay. Wrong one. Come, Dragonborn. Attend to Master Bonnie. How do I do the whirlwind one then? Shouts. Whirlwind sprint. Uh, equip. Hello. How's that? That was alright, right? Your quick mastery of a new thune <coughs> is uh, <coughs> astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. Uh, I thought this was easy. I thought it was this easy for everyone. I don't know how to do it. It just happens. Thank you. What's next? You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder. Horn of Jürgen Windcaller. In the ancient fane of Ustengrafen. Ustengrafen. Remain true to the way of the voice. You will return. I'm after find the horn of Windcaller. It belongs to Jürgen of the Sturgen. Uh, why are the dragons returning? Does it have something to do with me? What does it mean to be dragonborn? Why are shouts in the dragon language? There are only four of you. Tell me about the grey ears. Grey beards. Who was you between He was a great war leader of the ancient Nords. A master of the voice or tongue. Oh. After the disaster at Red Mountain, where the Nord army was annihilated, he spent many years pondering the meaning of that terrible defeat. Terrible defeat. He finally came to realize that the gods had punished the Nords for their arrogant and blasphemous misuse oh. of the voice. He was the first to understand that the voice should be used solely for the glory and worship of the gods, not the <laughs> I didn't know you speak Norwegian here, Sestroya. Only a little bit. eventually overcame all opposition in the way of the voice. Ah, yes, okay. So, Jürgen Twintkuller. Uh, let's go and find Jürgen of the Twintkuller. Uh, this way. Hmm. What's this guy doing? I'll tell you what he's not doing. He's not getting away with that easy. Oh, <laughs> arg! He says. Alright, going through here, are we? They've managed to teach you the ancient power of flatulence, says Mark Jones. Well, Mark Jones, I think you'll find I've known about that since a very early age. 
nice floating pot there in um What are you doing? Wolfgar! What the f- Why are we down there, Wolfgar? Oh my word! Right, let's carry on before things get too rude. Hey, Ollie Lundmark! Alright, where's the- Where's the next one of my quests, then? Over there, Ustengrav, retrieve the hog of Jurgen Windkoller. Gordurgen. Alright, well, let's fast travel to somewhere over here and take a walk over some mountains and see what we can do. White Run Stable, as that's outside. Let's go that way. So, time to just go off now and get into crazy adventures rather than. You know, we're still following the main path, the main quest line, but it's. You know, now it's opened up a little bit more. Big difference in graphics, Ian says. Kiran one. I don't think it's massive difference in graphics, to be honest. Um, yeah, I I don't know. Not not hugely different, I don't think. I'm just gonna wait till till t morning. I'm waiting till the morning when it's sunny. Don't like to do these uh, do these quests before it's sunny. All right, I'm back. We're here to teach you a lesson. What? Never should have come here. Holy shit! <laughs> why? What are you? Why? Hired thugs? What? Why? Why? Why are you hired? Who's hired you? Oh. What? He just hit his mate. Right. At least they're being polite and kind of waiting. You're ready to die today, nope. Huh? I'm not ready. Ah. Oh. These hired thugs, right? They're pretty tough. One of them's kind of burnt a bit. Okay, right. That guy with the sword's got a longer reach than the others. There's some good sidestepping here. If I was a standard build that I'd normally do, I'd be laying into these guys with a massive mace by now. Instead, I've got a fanny around like a mage. One's dead. That's what you get. Run through the middle. Owie, my butt. Maybe I should eat a potion of magicka or something. Oh. Uh. I got him. It's just you left now, sucker. Bits of burning. Burning him little bits at a time. Nearly gone as. Nearly gone as. Got ya, ya shit. Fanning around like a mage is the name of my new band, says Lassus. <laughs> Watching a video of Ian's twin brother on Eurogame and talking about PSVR that was recently uploaded. Ha ha, says Serial Knight. He's a nice guy, that Ian on Eurogamer. Uh. I like him. He seems like a sensible guy. Um, you should definitely go over to youtube.com forward slash Eurogamer and uh, watch his videos and perhaps subscribe. Because yeah, he seems seems like he seems friendly and knowledgeable. And also a little bit sexy. Right. What were they say what was their orders? Who did their orders come from? Uh, books would it be in? Contract, here we go. Here is the agreed upon amount. I expect you to faithfully carry out my request to teach a lesson to the thief, Olaf von Buttminster. 
You need not kill him, but I have no qualms about it if you deem it necessary. Moira? Who the hell is Moira? Am I supposed to remember who Moira is? I can't remember. Use a mason to fire. Set them on fire, then bash them to death, says Stephen Reeves. I've got my double fists of flame here. That's all I need. My hot fingers. My hot fingers are fun. We'll uh, deal all the damage. Might take a while. But it, it gets there in the end. Moira from Fallout 3, says Mr. Snakecake. Well, she definitely needs to send, teach me a lesson, because I blew up her town. Uh, ooh, look at you. Come back here. No, I don't want to kill him. I feel bad. Uh, giants, is that a giant's camp down there? Yeah, it's a giant's camp down there. I probably should avoid the giants. They're pretty... Uh, Pretty brutal. I heard the rest of the Eurogamer staff envy that Ian for his looks, says Stroyer. Well, I, I'm not surprised, you know. Uh, they're all a good looking bunch, that Eurogamer team, but that Ian, something about him is definitely, uh, he's definitely the better looking of, uh, of the four, I think. Definitely. If I had to kiss one of them, it would be him, for sure. Uh, ooh, crabs. Giant crabs. Should we see how giant crabs... Oh, wait. Nope, let's see how an elk deals with fire. Not very well, it turns out. It was bad for his health? No, that doesn't. It, it was supposed to sound like health, but it didn't really. It didn't really. Oh my god! Who are these guys? Now you all pay. Fire arrows at this, you it. Uh, gold. And you. He's dead. Oh, he did. He did that old fireburn fall. Ow! Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, he's lightning me and stole my magic. Ah! Oh. oh, and there's a mud crab kicking in the ass. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, Hot Fingers Fun is now my band's name, says Stroyer. Stephen Reeves agrees, that's a good name. Or if you ever need a band's name, just watch one or two of my streams and I'm sure I'll come out with plenty of them. Alright, I died, and I'm back here now, so that's cancelled out my elk, it's cancelled out those people who tried to kill me, damn it, how annoying. <clears throat> I need to remember to save more. Uh, hey Mike Tiger, welcome. Looked up, there is a Moira in Skyrim, and you haven't seen her yet. So guess what, another Skyrim bug, uh, I mean feature, says <laughs> Mr. Snakecake. Well, oh, here they are, look, they're back again. Hi! We're here You're to looking you a little a rough around the edges. You oh, fuck! Oh. Ah, what the? <laughs> Why, well, he just headbutted me to death! What the fuck? <laughs> I've never seen that happen before. He just like literal dosh, 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 dosh. Wow, what a way to what a way to go. Head butted to death. My word. Let's try that again. Surprise! Oh, one's dead. A bit quicker than last time, at least. 
Let's just wait. I'll build up a bit of magic before I strike. Okay, time to burn. Uh, nothing like looting a dead body while you're trying oh, not to get hit by war axe. Fuck. Oh, my die again. Uh, items. Potions. That one. Um, potion of... No potion of magic. Potion of the night? What's that? Increase heavy armor skill. Scrolls. Scroll of fireball. How do I use it? X. I don't know how I used those scrolls. Oh, fuck, maybe it's that. So that's how you work the scrolls, anyway. Uh, destruction. Oh no, ow! Something terrible has happened and Bjorn arms after me. Oh well. Has he forgiven me? Oh, be your arms, Jim. Wait. Ah. Oh. oh. Guess it's all clear now. <laughs> I aggroed a farmer, and uh, he killed me. <clears throat> all right, this time, fuck's sake. <laughs> this time, I'm going to do it without aggroing any farmers. Without dying, it's gonna kill these fools, and I'm gonna carry on with my mission. You just stomped his crops, says Redcap. He got angry because I set fire to his crops and his horse, maybe. Look at that horse in the background there. <laughs> Look at the way that horse turns. <laughs> what that horse is a tank or something. Look at these guys. Come over here, away from the farmers and the horses. Is going a lot, burning for a lot longer when I've only used one hand. Oh, chips! Come on, Hadouken! Time to finish this. Doing. You're running away from these nerds. Okay, he's down. Just you left, mate. You want all that bounty for yourself? Perhaps you should just run away. Might be better for you. That's all I'm saying. Magic. Destruction. Flames. Uh -oh. 
Yeah, using both at the same time really depletes. Ah! Oh, oh, what the fuck? So instead of looting the body, like going in and looting the body, for some reason, like at a button press, I don't know what I did there, at a button press I picked up everything on that body and then it over encumbered me and then I couldn't move out of the way and that guy headbutted me to death. Fuck. So I guess I'm doing that again. I am so saving when I finally kill these fuckers. I did it first time last time. What the shit? Hello, Coolzy. God damn it. <clears throat> Go on, Dix. I'm still a weak mage. I think I'm level four at the moment. Ha Dukin! Ha Dukin! Why is this guy's health not going down very fast? There we go. Got ya, sucker. Hire this, thug. Come on, mate. Toasty! Whoa, shit! Toasty! There we go. Hey, Mr. Stronger from Portugal. High five to Portugal. Welcome to the show. Right, search. Right. Search. Money! There we go. Right. Back on track. Back on track. I'm from the UK, Mr. Stronger. Hi from Manchester. It's cold, smelly, but we have pie, says Lazarus. I know Manchester. I know Manchester. All right, double flames. Dead elk. Take the venison. I'll take the venison, and I shall eat the venison. Okay. So. Heading straight down that gap there between the mountains. That seems like the best way to go. Uh, unfortunately, there's this kind of weird fortress thing here that's guarded by bandits. Which is where I met my doom last time. Now, sensible people would probably try and stealth their way past. But I'm not that sensible. Hello, Brett Curtis. How's it going, Brett Curtis? Here's the bandits. Oh, they've seen me. Now, these bandits weren't too strong. I managed to burn the archers pretty quick. 
But it was their mage was a bit of an asshole. That's their mage there, so that's uh recharge my magicka before I go out and take on that mage. I made it up the mountain still life. I've done I've done that bit now, thankfully. Hey Boshk the bounty hunter. Oh. She's a fire mage now. Oh my god. Ow. Items. Uh potions. Uh that, that, that. Nothing great. What's that? Enchanter's potion. <laughs> right. Oh. A Nordic barnacle? I'm going to take that just because it looks funny. Did she die? I'm sorry. Burn her corpse. Uh, this bandit died. Any gold? Seven gold. Me. Ooh, we've got a little store here. Anything good? Uh, some wine. Me. Silent Moon's camp discovered. Well. It would be rude not to steal all their food. Go in, so I can go inside Silent Moon's camp. Is that something I want to do, do you think? It looks like it's guarded by low-level bandits, so... Ooh. Hello. Oh, shit. Falling down into that was a bad idea. Ow. 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 Out. Out. Ha ha. Ow. Ooh. Increase my smithing. Just like mid battle, just fuck off. Reading some shit. The Lunar Forge. I managed to get the forge itself up again and running. Uh, hmm. These special. Lunar Iron. Lunar War Axe. Lunar Iron Mace. Search chest. Iron Mace of Draining. Might as well. Amethyst. Yay! And a Staff of Fury. More weaponed up. Alright, where are you? You big. Ooh. Iron ingot. Where are you, big dump? It's a wizard off! Ow. This mage is more powerful than me, and he's... Oh, nice. He'd run out of magic, he was going to try and stab me to death, but I... Burnt his little socks off. Burnt his little cotton socks off. Alright, so... That's that bit done. Ah, what the fuck? Reading comments and trying to control characters is always a bit weird. Um, <clears throat> Shock resistance potion Ian, says Lassus. Oh, too late for that now. I hardcored my way through it. Alright. Let's, let's head inside. Might as well. I'm going to... Quick save. Let's see what we got in here. Oh. Keep it stealthy for now. We don't know who's in here. Yeah, people, people talking. These things, Nord Mead. 
on the lookout for like potions of healing. They're the things that I I think need a lot. Oh shit! Potions of healing are what I need a lot of. There's an orky looking guy. Had some had some gold. Not much else though. Search bandit. Gold. What's that? That's a longbow. I thought it was a trap on the floor. Chest. Uh, gold, gold and iron. I guess the iron's used for smithing. Uh, need me some skooma. Oh, he's a druggy. Huh? Skooma, this sucker. Nice. Where are you, bandit? I don't want to. There we go. Ten. Unlock iron door. You should get a companion in. They're very OP. Basically, a pack horse hit sponge. I've not come across anyone that can be my companion yet, unfortunately. Wow. Jesus Christ. Gently does it. Fuck. Ah, oh, you little shit. My lock picking skill must be well rubbish. Finally! Holy shit. Use like 10 lock picks for that. Better get some more good ones in here. Not bad though. Uh, a little stash room. Gold, healing. I did say I wanted a potion of minor healing. Well, I wanted healing potions of all types. Bread, hmm. Plate, hmm. Pot, hmm. Uh, what do we got here? Plentiful stamina potion. Potion of extra magicka. Ooh. Yes, please. Lunar steel war axe. Me, I already grabbed a couple of lunar steel weapons. Solution of health, regeneration there. Yes, this is this is the mother load. Some money. A uh, little magicka potion. Uh, not too bad, I guess. I've had worse, worse bonuses. <clears throat> There's a mage in the pub in Riften for 500 G's and Lydia in White Run if you become Thane, so still life. The companions, eh? Oh, I'll definitely become Thane at some point because I'm hardcore. Ooh. Another, another chest. Gold, 49. Nice. Ding dong! Sweet. So that was that was a nice little mini dungeon, getting me a little bit more confident with my uh, magey skills. Now to head up this hill and find Jürgen Flurgen's Windblurgen, or whatever it's called. Dougie's back. He's got home after a hard day at work. He's back for more Skyrimmings. Come back here, elk. It's a deer this time. So, a deer, a female deer. It got really, really burned. Sorry, deer. I had to do it. No offense. I just needed to level up my fire. 
My destruction. Fuck. Ow, what? Well, the breeding! <laughs> Excellent wolf physics there. Wandering through. Oh, it's getting snowy again. We're entering the mountains. I remember walking down here back in the day when I played this game first time. <clears throat> I think there's a frost troll down here. Or maybe I'm imagining it. Looking a bit sinister. It's getting a bit nippy as well. Yep, I was right. There's a frost troll. Labyrinthan discovered. I'm gonna guess he's gonna be far too tough. Far too tough. Far too tough. Yep, run. I don't know what labyrinthan is, but. Oh, the guy should not stick around. Even to search the burial end. Oh, oh no, what a spaz. No, tiger. He had rubbish full damage. Hey, Cameron Hansen. I perhaps I should have quick saved then. Perhaps I should have quick save, but he said I cocked it up. Ah, at least not too bad at quick save coming out of that hole in the ground. Bing bong. Means I get to do that joke again. Poor kitty. This is still life. I should have just ignored the frost troll. I shouldn't have even tried fighting it. It's bad karma for uh, killing that deer, I think. That's what got me. La -de -de -de, jumping everywhere to increase my stamina. Funny! Oh, that made a quite a nice little noise. Mmm, lovely destruction increasing death. Okay, well, it's not. What the? What about you? Where's your mate? I don't know. Ooh, what's this? You look pretty. <laughs> you look pretty. So burn. Search the fox. Let's take the fox pelt, might as well. Right. Kaboosh, kaboosh. I quick saved that time, I remembered. Up here quickly. Hmm. I was hoping maybe there'd be some kind of shortcut over, but there isn't. Hi, Frosty! Frosty the Frost Troll! Frosty the Frost Troll! Oh shit! <laughs> Frosty the Frost Troll, he's a one hit killing machine! He will cut my face with one little swipe and he'll meet me on his dinner. What? Frosty the Frost Troll, he's gonna smash my head in. Right, so. I need to stun Frosty the Frost Troll so I can sneak past him. And how do I do that? Like that. See you later, Frost Troll. Oh, it's 
see. Doing this it was a bad idea, I think. Ah! I just love gold! Run! Oh, bullshit! Okay, Frosty the Frost Troll. Oh, fuck! There's another one. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. I wonder if it looks like there's good potential for looting. But it's well guarded by evil monsters. Oh! Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? Made it. Frost Troll. Gone us. Let's leave it like that. That was scary. Alright, Frost Troll has forgotten about me. <clears throat> We've got... Coming up... Is our uh, objective, but there's also some kind of weird structure on the map. A couple of... and a cave as well. All in this general direction. Now, am I going to get sidetracked? Who can knows? Uh, shall I fight whatever this is down here? Spiders? Ooh. Ooh. Nice. Crossbite spiders are pretty weak against my uh, double ended flamer all right this is this building here thing. what is this thing what is it though Kirschen stag ruins Discovered. All right. Let's try and unlock this. I've got. I've got two lock picks left. Oh, fuck. My lock picks break really easily in this game. Well, thanks. My lockpick may have increased. My lockpick skills may have increased, but my... Uh, the number of lockpicks in my possession has decreased to zero. You're near Morphal. You should stop there and buy the Firebolt spell, says Cameron Hansen. Uh, how do I get map? Wustengrave. Oh, there's Morthal. I can head to Morthal. Let's head to Morthal after I've done Wustengrave. Double-ended flamer, hot on the way in and hot on the way out, says Emma Harkham. <laughs> I've had, I've had quite a few of those uh, in the form of uh, curries, chicken nagas. I went for a chicken naga curry um, last week from a different takeaway that I normally do, and it was a lot hotter than the chicken naga I, I got. I, I've been getting in, in the streams, so I might change the takeaway I go to because it was pretty. It was pretty spicy. I liked it. Ustungrav discovered. Where's Jürgen Flurgen? Of the Schmergens. Like uh. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. Ow. Fuck. Potions. Uh, 
Bless you now. There we go. Some awesome potion drinking on the run. Where did that mage go? Necromancer. And there was a couple around here. Did they turn to ash or something? It's hard to... If their bodies turn to ash, it's hard to see them on this rock. Got them all. Whatever. That's the way in. Oh, there's a there's a deady. What are you, dead bandit? Jug of milk. Lock pick. Oh, oh, he had a garnet on him. All about the jewels. I love me some treasure. Potions of stamina. Soul of the bane of the undead. Sets undead. Up to level 30 on fire makes them flee for 30 seconds. That's quite a a cool spell, I guess. Alright, in we go to Ustengrav. When's the next big single player game coming out, says Stroyer? Uh, that'll be probably the, the next big game I'm really looking forward to. January 24th. Resident Evil 7. I'm going to look forward to playing that in PlayStation VR, baby. I'm well excited for Resident Evil 7. <clears throat> that's, yeah. As far as I can tell, that's the next big single player thing. Thralls of yours are slower than our billions. You know what's up there? Feel free to grab a pick and help them out. I prefer to sully myself with manual labor. Oh, I leveled up! Shout me some perks. Perhaps destruction. Because I can upgrade it now. <laughs> but it's up to you. So, it's Magicka Health or Stamina. And uh, also a perk. To, uh, to increase. Start spamming the... Uh, start spamming the comments and I will... Uh, I'll pick... One of each at random. Others must have found something. We'd better go see. These can tend to themselves for a few minutes. Uh, mine. Mine, mine. So there's these bandits, whoever those mages or whatever were, they're different to these bandits, I think, that I was fighting at the top. Maybe. Maybe. I looked in there, didn't I? Yes. Alright. Level up. Let's have a look. So, still life says destruction. So does Red Cap and There was a few people saying Mr. Snakesakes said conjuration. Um so I'm gonna go no one said magic or health or stamina, so I'm gonna go health. And I'll do destruction. And It was this one, wasn't it? Cast apprentice level destruction spells for half magicka. There we go. So that should make my fireballs cost less mag less magicka, I think. So that means I'll have to do less running around recharging, which will be excellent. Lassa says two handed. Two-handed, that's surely got to be a troll one, right? Thanks for your suggestions, though, everybody. I will uh, be levelling up again in no time. No time, so... Um, I 
you'll be able to suggest again very soon, I'm sure. Some weird noises happening. I need to get rid of some stuff because I'm over encumbered. <clears throat> what looks rubbish? Iron greatsword. Let's drop that. These things all look enchanted, uh, enchanted and cool. I kind of want to keep them, even though I'll never kind of use them. Banded iron armor. That's weight 35. And get rid of that. What am I wearing? Necromancer robes. Black mage robes. Magicka regenerates rates 50% faster. Necromancer robes. Magicka regenerates 75% faster. So that's. To be honest, that's better than that. Even though it's worth less. Uh, carrying capacity increased by 25 points. Can I equip that? There we go, I've equipped that. So I've got more. I can carry more stuff now. Iron shield, I will drop that. Oh, fuck, I accidentally. I pressed square once and um, it just. Did it twice. Studded armor of minor health. Increases your health by 20 points. I kind of want that. Where's my. I'm naked now, though. Necromancer robes. Uh, so, back to items. Back to apparel. And let's equip the necromancer robes. Right, I've got clothes back on now. And we're not over encumbered. Trousers. Get him off. Sounds like people are uh, having a big fat battle down here. Alright. Set fire to those two chumps. Elves' ear? The f oh, it's not actual ears, it's medicine for something. Wait, but. Black mage robes. Right. Black mage robes, skiva tail. Still, these are just items for crafting spells and shit. Lots of gold on these dragoners. Oh, look at this! Here we go. Look. Health potion. Health potion. Can't be bothered with the meads. I don't need no mead, yo. I don't need no mead, yo. Let's drag work, some gold. Must have been pretty rich, these guys. They've uh, got plenty of gold. Here's another necromancer. Ten gold. They should have just stopped fighting, pulled all their cash together, and had like a mad piss up. What is this thing? Crazy pots. Urns. Ooh. We put the mother load. Empty urn, empty urn, empty urn. Search the urn. Gold. Potion of healing. So, what? Well, coming in here was a good idea. Oh, fuck's sake. Stand up. There we go. Alright, let's keep searching this dungeon. What's that? There's nothing, it's a bit of scenery. Empty urn. Ah, chesticle, testicle, wallets and watch. Garnet, yay! Gemstones. All about the gemstones. Garnet, January's birthstone. I can't wait for Resi 7. I would love to play it with a PSVR, but I don't have one, says Steve Scott. Uh Like, I... I'm so excited. Like it's finally going to be like a big, a big game for the PlayStation VR rather than just a short little experience. Garnet, gold stamina, <laughs> gold stamina and myrrh. I've increased my restoration to 16 by reading the mystery of Princess Hrlabla. Oh, 
one. No, that's an empty urn. It says it's empty. Search urn. Gold. So much so much good stuff in here. I don't think I need to be stealthy at the moment. I'm pretty sure these rooms are all like little dead end storage rooms. And I've Killed pretty much everyone around. What's that? Potion of the Healer. Was that the book I've already read? Princess of Miss. Uh, yeah. Princess. Blah, blah, blah. Five gold. Aerial urn. Four gold. And a health potion. Sexy. Sexy. Everything about looting is sexy. I just want to loot everybody. And get some gold in my pockets. Nom 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 nom. Right, skeletons. Keeping stealthy. Don't know what's up ahead. Ooh. Gold pouch. Oh, we've got two ways to go. We've got a big cavern. And we've got this little passage down here. Check out the little passage first before I go and get overwhelmed in a big area. And it was a good idea because there's money, money, money! Didn't really want that axe, but I was spamming the pick up money button. I'll oh, forget about the axe now. I'm not over encumbered, so I'll, I'll leave the axe for now. But I will drop it at some point if I become encumbered again. Hello, Philip Epps Ekstrom. How's it going, sir? Battlefront 2 better have a PSVR campaign. Uh, or I'd like a standalone game, says Dougie. I'd love a proper, like, that Star Wars Battlefront. It's, basically, it's just a little PSVR experience stroke demo. It's awesome, but it's over too soon. and It gets really boring on repeated playthroughs because it's just a bit slow. No. What? Like clever clogs. Oh shit. You stop that right now. Patience. Healing. Magic. Oh god, he's got a mate. It's not good, it's not good, it's not good, it's not good. Ah, oh, nice. Finished him in his torch eyes off. Gold drop. <laughs> Quick save. They don't have to redo all that. They just need to make Rogue, remake Rogue Squadron in VR, says Snake Cake. That would be pretty awesome. me some gold and ow I think I was still on a trap or something there not sure what it was but made a weird like pain noise so let's not step on that again what are these things like coffins uh, iron Skyrim helmet Keep clicking the go third person button instead of the crouch button. Seems pretty quiet around here, like... I don't think there's going to be any enemies up top. So I, I reckon I would have... Like, the noise of all the fighting would have, like, made them come down. Skirmishers potion I got there, as well as a health potion. 
me up above. I'm up above. Ooh. Coin poise. Ah, oh, dead body there. Dropped that coin purse years ago. Into the Ustengrav depths. I'm repeated. I'm doing repeated playthrough story try uh, to try and beat your 70 Tie Fighter kills, says Dougie. <laughs> never. It's never going to happen. It'll never happen. Right. Let's quick save while I'm down here. Now go to White Run and treat yourself, says Still Life. What can I get in White Run? I I want the house. I'm not too bothered about anything in um, White Run except for the house. I need the house to uh, so I can store all my gold and enchanted weapons and stuff that I like to steal and never use. Fucking stealth, you prick. Oh, it's crazy how I actually re like remember that view. So I was having like the reason I just went quiet and stared over that uh, <laughs> is <laughs> over that ledge is because I was having like major like deja vu flashbacks. It's pretty creepy. So, not that way. Oh! Ow! Stood on a trap. Yakety yak stood on a trap. Uh oh. Ooh, look, see? Copper and onyx circlet. That's a nice bit of treasure. Pop that guy up from a distance. Sweet. Yeah, it is a pretty epic cave. You're right, Coolzy. Okay. Down, down, deeper and down. This is a guy I set fire to. He's got a petty soul jam on him. He's the soul gem. Do -do 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 -do. This little side room here. Has it got anything cool? It's got a chest in it. An orcish warhammer. And a scroll of mayhem. I'm not going to take the warhammer. The scroll of mayhem's all mine. Uh, some potions. Mine a healing potion, and there's another one there. All will come in very useful, I'm sure. What the fuck made that noise? Ah. Oh, he's up there. Well, I'm not sure how to get that guy. He'll probably come and get me. Come and get me. He's up there, or is he? There he is. Ah! Ah. Frost v fire. Who's gonna win? Well, kind of like a stalemate. Oh! Stop it with your freezing fists! Got him. Got him! Rena Watts here. Hey, Kenneth Wright. Yes, I did finish Dark Souls 3. Um, I did do the DLC though because fuck that noise! I only managed to. I'm surprised. Oh, look at that cheese. Uh, I'm surprised I managed to complete Dark Souls 3 without having a breakdown. It took me quite a while, to be fair. And I did have to have a three month break. But I did it. Had to. Uh, had to get quite a lot of summons help in the end, but. If that was cheating, you wouldn't be allowed to do it. Well, there was a trap up there. But there wasn't. Hello, Simon M. The 
best thing, one of the best things about people are saying that people are happy about the fact that I stole loads of cheese then. One of the best things about Christmas is all the cheese. So many cheeses for measers. Pleasers. I'm well up for like well, big cheesy feasts. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Hi all! That didn't work too well. Ow. There we go. Super brilliant. Alright, is he ash? Has he turned into a pile of ash? No, he's there. Six gold and six gold and a silver ingot. I'll take the silver ingot for sure. Right, what's this here? Is this like a doorbell? Bing bong! It's opened one of those doors. What about this one? Is this gonna open the other? Yeah. Ruined book. Ooh, petty soul gem. Potion of light feet, huh? What's this? An arcane enchanter, so I can enchant weapons on that, can't I? Uh, but not much use, because I'm not really using any weapons. And got the soul gems and stuff. Alright. Let's keep going. My Christmases have never been all that cheese heavy, to be honest, says Lassus. What? Hey yo yo McDing Dong! He's done a song in the style of the Animaniacs. He says it's time for Pyromaniacs and he's zany to the max. So just sit back and relax, you'll laugh till you collapsed. He's a Pyromaniac. Nice. I like a bit of chutney with my cheese as well, Emma Harkham. Uh, you get, like, oh, it's awesome. You get all these crazy biscuits to eat with your cheeses and all these special chutneys. I like tomato chili chutney. Um, and I don't, do you know, like normally, throughout the year, I will never eat blue cheese, but then at Christmas, I'll eat a shitload of blue cheeses. Seasonal blue cheese scoffings. Troll skull. Just a, just a random table with nothing else but a troll skull on it. Seems legit. Just discovered port and cheese, it's amazing, says Magical Mitch. How many deaths has Ian had so far, says Michael Patterson? I think about six, maybe seven? More than I'd want, basically. Okay, cool. Skeletons. I'm not too much of a big deal. They're weaker than the dragons. They don't have any pockets, so I don't know. Oh, silver garnet ring. I don't know how they carry all these things. There's a fire up there. There's another skeleton there. What's all up with this fire? Oh, fuck, he's trapped. Alright, that's what that is. Garnet and an oricalcum ingot. Oricalcum. What's that from? What other game did I need to find oricalcum? Was that in Dragon Quest Builders? It might have been. There's another. these arrow twats. Where are you, arrow boy? It's hiding like a douche. Right. 
range isn't good enough. There we go. That got him. That got him. Bone meal. This skeleton on the throne had nothing on him except for an axe. Rather disappointing. But he did have a potion of the night. There. And what's this potion here? Extra magicka. So a few little bits of potions here and there. Not too bad, I guess. Slowly healing. Now what am I doing? Am I going downwards? Or upwards or acrosswards? Many ways to go. Perhaps this way is not wise, because it's... Oh, I could just... I could just do this, I guess. Uh, well, that avoids those fire traps, at least. There we go. Good choice for me, because that's taken me to gold and potion. Drop down. Darken these caves. They could do with some strip lighting, maybe. Oh! Flawless garnets. Love the gems. So many gems. So little time. Um, in fact, can I go magic? Powers? No. Illusion? Restoration? No. Destruction? No. All? Night Eye. Here we go. What? That didn't work. How does night eye work? Oh, no, um, I think that did it. Night eye kind of just turns things an annoying shade of black and white and a bit wobbly. Doesn't really make it that easier to see. Just makes it a bit weirder. How do we get through? How do I turn night eye off? I don't like it. How do I get through to that? There must be a way. <clears throat> hey! John Boob's back and he's got internet! It's less than half the speed of the internet I have in the old house, but it's internet nonetheless. Ah, nice one. Welcome back, John Boobs. Alright, don't know how to get to that. Oh, wait. Is it something to do with up there? Don't know how I'd be able to get up there. It was. Oh, fuck it. I'll forget about it one day. <clears throat> I have a quick look down here, but I seem to remember it's up there that I need to be going. Don't know what's down here. Oh, it's a dragon word. Learn me dragon words. Word of power learned. Fade become ethereal. Thanks. I like learning words. Secret passage? Yeah. Secret passage behind waterfall gets. Oh, fuck. Beats. He made me jump. He did. I'm not ashamed to admit it, but I murdered him in revenge. Good! Soul gem! A pretty lacklustre chest, to be honest. Don't you do it, Emma. Ooh, 
tell me uh, half a little yawn stretch. Yawn stretch. Okay, what time is it? So, this is gonna be, I guess, my next big stream series, considering there's not much else out at the moment. I will, of course, be uh, still doing multiplayer things like Rainbow Six. I haven't done any Battlefield for ages. I really want to do some Battlefield soon, because I, I, <clears throat> I've not played it for a long time, and I kind of... Like, I really want to... I don't know whether I'll stream it, to be honest. I might do, but I, I really want to play the new Star Wars Battlefront DLC. Because I played it before I saw Rogue One, and now I've seen Rogue One. I know how well it ties in with the film, so I want to play it again. Now that I know what the deal is with the film. Not exactly the best, most popular game to stream. So I might just do that in private. You never know. Titanfall. Oh yes, and Titanfall as well. How much longer will you be streaming for today, Ian? Says Michael Patterson. Depends how hungry I get. I was planning to finish at five, but I might go three till six. I will need to end at some point. I can't stream too late tonight because I've, got, uh, I, I've already said earlier my plans for tonight is to uh, wrap Christmas presents and watch Die Hard while I do it. So I'm going to get, once this stream's done, I'm going to pop to the shops. I'm going to pop to the shops Shooting at me, and I'm gonna buy some dinner, and I'm gonna buy some beers, and then I'm gonna come back. And I'm gonna stick on Die Hard, put the put the log fire on, get all cozy and Christmassy. It's gonna be sweet. Ah, oh, I didn't want those arrows. Poo arrows. Pooey arrows. Uh, is this is where I have to use the. Why can't I use that? Dragon souls are required to unlock shouts. Oh, okay. Uh, well, in sprint. Oh. Oh, I can double, I can, looks like I can do them real quick. Why are they staying open now? Oh no, they're not staying open. Why, why would you do this? Made it! I made it! Probably there was an easier way to do that, but I made it! 
<clears throat> what do you think of all this stuff about YouTube's trending recommended alg algorithms being set to favour younger channels? This is Electric Skeletor. I don't know. Whatever way YouTube's algorithms are working, they're definitely not favouring me, unfortunately. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh! Destruction increased, whoa, big and... Hey, what? Fuck, I've been poisoned, bollocks. Oh shit. Potions. Where's a thing? Frostbite venom. No. These don't seem to be resistant to poisoning. Magic a potion. Yeah. There we go. Screwed up. Screw you, frostbite. Uh, it certainly gives me an excuse for my poor views, given my channel as a gameplay person. I've been doing it for seven years. I've not heard anything about the YouTube algorithm favouring newer channels, to be honest. I mean, this channel's been going for about five years now, so... I'm sticking my hands in a sack there. Um, I don't think there's any algorithms going to favour this one. When, uh, when, YouTube, when YouTube Live first started, I liked that, YouTube Gaming, because I kept getting put on the front page of streaming. But then all of a sudden that stopped. Uh, which is a shame. I don't know why. I think it's because I don't stream regularly enough or long enough. I think they only place people who stream like like for five hours plus per day on it. Which is a shame because I don't have. I just don't have the time with a full time job and everything. It's a young man's game is streaming. And a young, young woman's game, of course. I'll go swimming. So, how do I open this? Do I have to do a shout? Oh no, read mysterious notes. Here we go. Dragonborn, I need to speak to you urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood and I'll meet you, a friend. Meet whoever took the horn. Oh, someone's took the horn, but I want the horn. Normally it's me with the horn. Okay, earn gold. Smash down. Open wooden door. <gasps> Ooh, search on. Here we go. We're, we're hitting the gold mother load. Stamina. Go, go. Rings. <gasps> Money. Um, empty, empty, empty. Ernie! Gold. Mm -hmm. More gold here. Oh, look at that lovely gold. What's in the chest? Orcish greatsword. Mm -hmm. Amethyst, though, and a gold. Cool. So many gems, so little time.
Right. Let's keep going through here. Open to Ustum Grab. <clears throat> Checking my tweets. Oh, someone's tweet me. I just watched your PSVR video and love to buy myself one, but a concern I have is how many gigabytes the games take. Should I upgrade to 500 gigabytes or. Uh, oh, I'll answer that in a. I'll answer that after this stream, but the, the games don't take very many gigabytes at all, which is good to know. Let's carry on. Let's carry on. What are we going to find? Ooh, a lever. I love levers. Oh, look where we are. We're back in this room of pops. Excellent. All right, well, we can make our way out from here. Go to River Run and find out who's stolen my horn. I want my horn back. Give me my horny back. Give me my horny back, you witch. I want my horny back. Give me my horny back, you mage. Right, so we are here and we can go to map. And world map is square. So I made it up to there, look. River run. Wait, was it right white run or river run? Yeah, riverwood, that was it. Meet whoever took the horn. Fast travel to Riverwood. Yes please. Who was it that set up the Platform 32 Xbox group? Says Emma Harkham. I've got no idea, Emma Harkham. <laughs> it wasn't me. <laughs> I didn't even know there was one, I don't think. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, this is a lot nicer than snowy mountains, isn't it? You there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. Yes, you've got a, a, an odd face. Good morning, wife. Your lies fall on deaf ears, Deceiver. The true Dragonborn comes. You are but his shadow. You're a shadow of a butt. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. They're going to attack me in the middle of this village. Oh god, they are. Right, so what I don't want to do... Oh my god, they're going to kill everyone in the village. If I start fighting these people, right, I will end up getting some of the villagers by accident, and then the whole village will turn against me. Oh no, everyone's dying. Get up! This isn't Swordy Man. Oh, fair enough. Search the cultist. Magicka regenerates 75% faster. Maybe I'll steal the cultist robes. They look kind of cool. Take the... Take the uh I'm gonna dress up as a cultist. Fuck it. Oh no. Sigrid. Key to Alavar's house. Sigrid died. Oh no. So many people died. Who's this? Oh, it's a cultist. It's fine. Oh, there's someone up here, though. Here's an innocent that's died. Alavar died. Oh my god. 
basically him and his miss, Alivor and his wife died. Well, at least I guess that they don't have to be on their own for a while. Um... Mm. Quite a few responses to the that video on Eurogamer that that sexy Ian guy did. I'll have to read them later. Be rude to read them while I'm streaming. Uh, what are we doing? We are going to the apparel, and I'm going to equip gloves, mask, robes, and boots. And I'm going to dump the necromancer robes, and I'm going to dump the imperial light boots. Um... Can I wear the rings? I can. I've got the charm. Does that do anything? Might as well drop the black mage robes as well. Don't really need them. Studded armor of minor health. Does that take over the robes? It does. So let's put the robes back on. Okay, now my cat looks like a badass. Hello. What could it mean? The return of the dragon. Hello, Arnie. And who among us could possibly hold that honor? Right, where's Alavar's house? Alavar and Singrid's house. Unlock. Novice. Is this gonna... I don't know if they're gonna get angry at me for doing this. Not Alavar, says Michael Johnson. Thanks for watching CRS 8009, he's gone. Why don't you sell those items, says Sammy. That would be sensible, wouldn't it? I guess. Alright, gold. Ransacking the house. Now that... Keep an eye out for trouble. Oh, fuck. It's only a matter of time. Hadava. Can't wait to kill another of Ulfric's boys. Mate, I just... Wow, how come I didn't get... How come I'm not getting done for robbing? Wow, can't believe those... The people that greeted me... ...were the ones that murdered me. What happened? Were the ones that died. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only... Okay. What is it? Let's see here. I've got a letter and a lot of gold. Ooh. Something about it being your, uh, Oh, inheritance! Oh, nice. Sorry for your loss. Sweet. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Okay, what? Wait, what? I want the. Oh yeah, and what would you rather do? Nope. Sorry. About... He gave me some. I, I guess he gave me some gold. I don't know. It didn't make a gold noise. Book in, cultist orders. Board the vessel nor Northern Maid and docked at Ravenrock. Take it to Windhelm, then begin your search. Kill the false dragonborn known as Olaf von Buttminster before he reaches Solstheim. Return with the word of your success and Mirak will be most pleased. Okay, and the letter of inheritance. Olaf von Buttminster, the na in the name of the great Jarl Bagruf, in the name of Jarl Bagruf the Great, it is with great regret that we inform you of Alavor's death. The deceased has bequeathed unto you a measure of inheritance the amount of a hundred gold pieces. The Jarl's court has levied you an amount of ten gold pieces on the sum as a lawful and honourable due tax. The remainder has been commended into the care of the trusted courier for deliverance. While all of the Jarl's court grieves with you this day, we rejoice in the knowledge that the deceased was in possession of dear friends and wealth to communicate with them. May this lawfully bestowed inheritance prove as a reminder of your enduring faith in one another. Oh wow. Poor Alivar. Shut up. Hey, no Such a shame. Uh alright, let's go and get those things and then sell them. By the gods, it's true, isn't it? A dragon has attacked White Rock. How could we men bring down such a beast? Riverwood Trader. Let's go to the Riverwood Trader. Well, one of us has to do something. I said Emma no. Harkin. No adventures, no theatrics. Oh, no I thought Emma was saying she had a Amazon delivery. Well, what are What's you going, going to here? do then, huh? Let's hear it. Yeah, let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh. <clears throat> Hello. A customer. Yes. Sorry you had to hear that. Me too. What are you saying? Maybe you could talk some sense into my pig-headed brother. Okay. What are you saying? 
The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid <clears throat> gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Dragon's claw? You found it! <laughs> there it is! What? Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, I don't know I'm, how I got the golden dragon I'm claw. I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. You're welcome. Golden claw removed. Four hundred gold added. Well, I have no Thank idea where that so happened. What happened there? Taking care of those thieves. The what have you got trinkets, for sale? Odds and ends. All right, I want to. Sort of items above the divide line belong to the vendor. Items below the line belong to you. Okay. What divider line? Oh, this divider line. Alright, I want to sell. That. I want to sell that. And that and that. And I might as well sell... Oh, it's, oh, I'll keep that. It's enchanted. I'll keep it. I want to sell that. Did that work? Some may call this I junk. Don't know if it me, or not. I call them treasures. Yeah, it worked. Right, potions. Minor healing. Let's have three of them. Minor magicka as well. Might as well. Destruction spells cost 12% less to cast. Oh, let's buy. Let's buy the circlet of minor destruction. Novice robes of destruction. Destruction spells 12% cast. Magic regenerates. Mm. Meh. Alright. Excellent. Till next time. It means so much to us to have the claw back where it belongs. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. I have no idea it's a fine where day I f around. where I got it from or how it became in my possession, but never mind. Uh, all right, apparel and what was it? Circlet of minor destruction. So that's taken the place of the mask. So the mask did give me a bit of armor, but this is going to make my destruction spells slightly more. It's going to give them. A little bit more badassery. Oh, buy the cure disease potion too, Ian, says Michael Patson. Okay. The golden claw is from the first dungeon. Oh, that's why I don't remember that then. That was uh, over a month ago I did that. Careful now. Trinkets, odds and ends. That sort of thing. Potions. Cure disease? Potion of cure disease. And apparel. Sell the cultist mask. There we go. Mm -hmm. Thanks, bye. I need to order in food soon, says uh, John Bob. John Bob. Half man, half takeaway. He says he thinks he'll have a korma. Have a chicken naga. Chicken tikka naga. Do that. <clears throat> It'd be yummy. Yummy scrummy. Yummy scrummy. Yummy scrummy. Right, can't steal them. Hello. Talk to Delphine. Hey, I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. I'd like to rent the attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Okay. This one. Nice. Close the door. Bedtime. What? Steel? Why would you leave mead in my room if you didn't so want to? The oh. I've been hearing so much about That's you. correct. I think you're looking for this. I am. We need to talk. Delphine. What? Follow me. 
It was you all along that went all the way down there, past all the mages and the dragons and the, the, the spooky skeletons. She's pretty beast. Still life's making pork and fennel meatballs tonight. Holy crap, that sounds awesome. Search chest. Close the door. Now we can talk. What? It's got made it. None of this stuff is stealing? Well, fine. If it's not red, it means I'm not going to get told off. I hope. These are all boozers, aren't they? Hornses. Bedsies. Searchy chesty. Coldsies. All right. Secret stealth room. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I'm a Greybeard. I hope they're right. What's a Naga? Naga is like a really... It's it's a curry made with a chilli called a Naga chilli. It's hot. It's hot. You're the one who took the horn? Surprise. I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless... Injury. She gave me the horn, though. So it's all right. What's with all the cloak and dagger? You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. Yes. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually <laughs> trying to help she you. She did give me the horn. Just need you to hear me out. Okay, go on, I'm listening. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Okay. How do I know I can trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Yep, I can, indeed. Good, and you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Um, so what's the part you're not telling Dragons me? aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. Uh... I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Please do. So where are we headed? Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. All right. Locate the dragon burial site. Let's go kill a dragon. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute, and I'll be ready. Well, okay, then. Read the Book of the Dragonborn. Book of the Dragonborn. Blah, 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 words. Mappy, mappy. Take map of Dragonborn. That's better. What? Let's get on the road to Kynes Grove. Alright. Potion, potion. We can go once I've managed to steal Orgnar, I'm all your stuff. Orgnar. Right. Happy trails. Orgnar, Orgnar. Oh, that one's empty. 
Large sack is empty. Alright, let's go. Kynes Grove is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. Did you want what what would you want to do? Wait, uh items. Books. Look at Dragon Earthers book. Miscellaneous. Map of Dragon Burials. Can I look at it? Hmm. Doesn't look like I can look at it. Let's have a look at the map. We've got a dragon bear. What's that there? Return the horn to Argonir Gnara. So that's one of the missions. And then we got locate dragon burial sites there and there. So there's two dragon burial sites over there. But I guess before I go and do that, let's go and return the horn to High Froth. <laughs> Her High Hrothgar. I'm back. I've got a new outfit. And I'm going to give you the horn. Hello there, Mr. Neely. Aranger. You've retrieved the horn of Jürgen Winkoller. Jürgen Winkoller! Well yes. You have now passed all the trials. Sweet! Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Dragonborn. You are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da. Da. Which means push. Da. Your da means push. What? Oh my god. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Okay. Master Wolf will give you his knowledge of the Give me your da! Okay. Stand between us and prepare yourself. What? Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeard. Oh my god. But you are These old men are going to shout at me to death. Oh, shit! Lingra crosses Saran, Stratulu, Voth, Nin, Balan, Klov, Pra now. Now. The Nal Thu Mu of Fanny Nu Dovakin Nal Select Du Khan Nal Select Du Shore Ark Nal Select Du Atomara Soul Don't you stay down fuck rock No more shouting. Dovahkin, you have tasted the voice of the great. Yeah, it was minging. Brush your teeth, you dirty old bastard. High Hrothgar is open to you. Yes, Hrothgar! I completed the horn of you can win cool here. Alright, let's throw it off. Oh, wrong one. Smash, smash my face into a wall. Lovely stuff. Fusserudar, are you right in the face? Clov Pran now sounds like a horrendously spicy curry, says Michael Patterson. Sure does. Oh. Whoosh! Ah! 
All right, we're out of here. They're happy with me. I've done the deed. So let's go. Let's make our way to these dragon burial sites. Let's fast travel to Golden Rock and make my way there. Making my way to Golden Rock, gonna find some things to do. Maybe kill a dragon or two, or maybe I'll just kill you. I'm the Dragonborn. Where the hell is in the singing my song? Oh shit. Let's avoid the, uh. Let's avoid the giants. Evening, evening, evening. Lads, 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 lads. It's fine, lads. Okay, we're going off road. Where's that? It's a goat. Death goat. Why is everyone's first question when they join the stream how many times has Ian died? It's almost like you think I die a lot in video games. Absolute nonsense. <coughs> Blear! There's something up there. Should I be worried? Should I be looking in this building? It's like a weird bridgey type thing. Valtime Towers discovered. Are you a goodie? Hold it. This ah. a toll road, see? You're gonna have to hand over, say... <laughs> no, mate. How about you let me through and I don't kill you? Sounds good to me. Huh. Tough talk for someone who's about to have their guts spilled. Ha! Tough talk for someone who's about to get set on fire. Now, this is a surprise. Boom! Ah. Blah. Yeah. Nice work, Tuffo, with your big sword. Your stupid dead body. Ooh. Healing, healing. Mm. Oh, yes. oh, what? Ooh. Oh, what is this? Yeah. Unlocked a trap. Ooh, and what have we got? Soul gem, 69 coins, and a potion of some stamina type stuff. Search the dresser. So it looks like we're on a. Yeah, it's a bandit's. bandit's castle. Alright. There's quite a few of them. So I'm gonna quick save. Ow! Ow! Bandit chief. What? Where's the bandit chief? Is that the bandit chief? No, it's just a... Ow! What the fuck? Ow! Oh, there's the bandit chief. Yeah! You like burning, do you? I want some more! Yeah! We dance around this table all day until I've set you on fire to death, huh? Come on, chase me! Chase me, quicker! Come on, chase me! Wow, you died! Wow. Unlucky, potter! There we go, 56 gold. Now let's... Let me get back to my cheesing, thank you very much. Yeah, cheeses. Cheeses. You won't live to see tomorrow either. Ow! Oh. Burning! Yeah, you're burning too. What's that I smell? It's you. Burning. Ah. Where'd they go? Where the fuck did they go? Well, they burnt. They, I incinerated them. What's this? Wardrobe. 
clothes rubbish. Alright, well. Got to run in a straight line towards an archer. That's not going to end without me getting a arrow in my face, I reckon. I'm down to the last 90 minutes of my chili jam cooking. Then I can put it in jars, give it to people as a gift, and watch them gasp in pain as they try to eat it, says Liam Salisbury. Send me some! Uh, right. Are we ready? Let's go pick up some archers. Ah, sidestep that arrow like a pro. Gold. Someone else is firing arrows at me. Must be someone in this building. She called me a cat. That's correct, I am a cat. Ho ho, I'm a cat. It's really dark. Not bothered about dresses. I want books that increase my stats. I want potions. There's one. And I want money. There's a sexy chest. On the arrows. Bloody arrows. Wine, wine. Potion of minor healing, though. We'll have that. What's that? Black arrow, V2. Archery increased. There we go. Didn't, don't really need it. But never mind. And here we are at the top. To get the goat's cheese. There's still someone around, but I don't know where they are. I don't know if it's worth even bothering to look for them, to be honest. Oh, there they are. Just was about to give up. Blarp! Okay. I've got a lock pick out of that. That's alright. So, we that was a lovely bit of... Lovely bit of a detour. Can I... Keep going this way on along the river. R two. Looks like I can keep going along the river. Perhaps I got to head. I got to get this way at some point. So let's just let's just head this way and see where it goes. I mean, what's the worst that could happen, right? Number thirty two Platform Street. <laughs> That's exactly where I live. Liam Salisbury. <clears throat> yeah, um... This is not a good way to go. <laughs> it's a dead end. Uh, yeah, giving out my home address on the internet is not a good idea. To be honest. If you did want to send me stuff, Send it to Eurogamer. Oh, ah. this is not a good. It's not a good idea, Ian. Shit. I'm gonna have to try it. Oh shit! I forgot to press jump. Oh, I died. <laughs> Whoopsie! Um...
Right. <clears throat> They're still going. Ian seems to like him some Skyrim Destroyer. I do like Skyrim. It's a lovely game. I really like Bethesda games. I'm a big fan of their games. Shit, it's a fucking current. Like they do, they do some pretty good games. They like my game of the year, Doom. Um, that they did that. Uh, one of my other games of the year, Dishonored 2, they did that. Fallout 4, one of my favourite games, they did that. All the Fallout games, well, the recent Fallout games, anyway. Skyrims and Elder Scrolls and all the things like that. They're going to do Prey, I'm looking forward to Prey. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm a fan of Bethesda's games for sure. Across the river and up this way. Wait, what? Okay, there's another like mammoth skull there. I don't know if it's another giant's house or anything. Ian, name your top three favourite game developers. Hi. Uh, let's see. I guess Bethesda would be in there. Kind of want to say Ubisoft because, like, they made Far Cry, which is like my favourite game, but. <clears throat> they keep like changing it and fucking it up and like making it worse. Heavy armor increased, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't really have a top three. Ian loves From Software, so it's still alive. Oh, yes, I love From Software. Codemasters, Bethesda, and Ubisoft, says Liam Salisbury. There we go. Not a fan of, like, racing games, to be honest. So, like, recent Codemasters stuff, um, yeah. I can leave it. So I've got a cave and some kind of weird building around. Do you want to look in the cave or the weird building? The weird building's more... Um, in the uh, direction of... of the things I need to find. I need to be very close to the cave, but I can't see the entrance. Is that it over there? Should we go and check out this cave? Okay. Do a bit more like open world adventurizing and check out this cave, see what's in it. Lots of big bones. Oh. Egg sacks. Oh, there's gonna be spiders. This is a spidery cave. Kronvagar Cave! Naughty Dog. Yeah, I, I put Naughty Dog up there, definitely. Yeah, spiders. Oh, yeah. 
Let's just float. These spiders aren't too bad. Especially with my new awesome tiara. Which totally isn't a tiara, of course. Oh, cough, cough, cough. Way to go. Oh, I didn't like I don't want to go off down a little passageway just yet. I want to make sure I've found everything there is to loot. Hello. What the fuck? Ow shit! Ow fuck ow! Why no ow? Vampires? Ah oh, fuck that. Fuck vampires. Help. Well, this is a... a big cave I've found my way into. Don't think the eggs hatch, thankfully. There's dead bodies floating in the water. Loot them or anything. Oh, mate, this water must be freezing. <laughs> to Krongver Brood Lair. These spiders sound like they're uh, they sound like a reloading shotgun when they die, says Emma Harkham. Let's have a listen to the reloading shotgun spiders. They do. <laughs> Potion of potion of the Uh, uh, it's okay, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, you're too big to fit down a hole. Come and get me, come and get me. Yeah, come and get me. Come and get me. Goblin and spunk in my face. They can't get me. Can't get me. Can't get me. 
I'm burning. So nearly dead. So nearly dead. So nearly dead. I'm gonna have a nice spider surprise roast once I finish with this. Lovely cooked spider legs. Nom 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 nom. Still burning. Still burning. There we go, you're dead. Roasted spiders. Crossbite venom. No, fuck it. I don't know why I need that. I don't know why I need it. Alright. Lots of cocooned peeps. Search the chest. Gold! Spell tone, candlelight. Creates a hovering light that lasts for 60 seconds. Oh, these are spells that I can learn. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Get these cobwebs out of my face. <coughs> cobwebs. <coughs> to Krongaria Cave. Yeah, Krongaria Cave. Off we go. It's going to drop me down somewhere. Boop. I do like how all the caves in Skyrim always like have a little back door that leads you out. Right. I'm going to quick save here. It's chances are I'm going to get vampirism now. Because this is a vampire. Oh! <laughs> Why didn't I remember that again? This is a vampire lair. Dead Dark Elf. Where are the other vampires then? There was one having dinner a minute ago, but. Oh. Hold on. How many are there though? Someone on the table. Lots of dead people. Just barely still hungry. Last kill so good. Just the right amount of struggle. Well. Something out there. Oh, did you? Yep. Yeah. Oh. I contracted the vampire thing again. Search Breton. Oh, shit. How do you can? Wow, those vampires are pretty weak. But now I'm going to turn into a vampire. Unless I pray at a shrine. And you know that I've forgotten where the shrine is, right? Chest. 53 gold. Seems to just be a little. Hello, area. Gold. Gold. Chest. Need to unlock that chest. There's one in white running in, says Still Life. Awesome. Cheers, Still Life. I'll head there next. God damn it. Well, at least we know it's this way. Oh, 
Come on now. Don't snap. Fuck! Nice. Nice. A lesser soul gem lesser. What? Okay, right, let's go back to White Run quickly and cure myself of vampirism before I turn into a vampire because that is a pain in the ass to cure. I did that on my last. I didn't know you could get rid of the sanguine of what's it. I didn't realise you could go and. Ow! I didn't realise you could go and pray to uh, get rid of it um, when I played the first time. So. I turned into a vampire and then had to like do this really convoluted thing to like turn back from a vampire. It was um it was pretty nuts. So we are here. So that's my current location. So we're close to the dragon um the dragony areas. But I need to go to Hytheron and go and pray at the altar. Smithing helps with lock picking. Not really, lols, says Emma Harkham. You're a cruel you're a cruel person, Emma Harkham. So cruel. Uh, hello, Blas Nekun says. Uh, just wanted to say hi, but alas, I must away. Work and everything. Uh, work. Hope everything is going well in Skyrim. It's going very well in Skyrim. It's going so well in Skyrim that I was supposed to finish this stream at five, but I'm going to go for another fifty minutes. And I'm going to stream up until six p.m. Go um, cast your fancy magic someplace else. Go shove your face Take up your ass. Hello. What are you looking at? I'm not. <clears throat> Gotta remember where the temple was. Is this the temple? No. Just had my dinner and surprised the stream is still going. Says Red Cap. Well, are you married? Like I said, uh, having a good time here. So I decided to play a bit more. Drops the Where The hell is the temple? Temple of Crying Earth, there it is. That one. Mister, could you spare a coin? Nope. Here it is. Heal me, baby. All diseases cured. Thanks. I feel better already. Bye. All right. So, because I feel better, I'll give you a coin. Just one gold. Here you go. Oh, thank you, divines. Bless your kind heart. Gift of charity added. Why are you begging? It's, it's what Brennan said I should do. He's the only one that's been nice to me since. Since Mama. Since Mama. Since she died. Oh. My aunt and uncle took over our farm and threw me out. Said I wasn't good for anything. I wound up here, but I, I don't know what to do. I miss her so much. Don't really care. I could adopt you if you want. Wait, what? Really? Do you do you have a place I could live? No. Oh well. Thanks anyway. I suppose. Guess I need a house before I can adopt really annoying children. Cute supplies. Alright, you can put your flaming hands away by holding down square. Wow. So there we go. Thanks, still life. Now I know about the flamey hands. And I will forget that instantly. 
because that's the kind of guy I am. Okay, so Krongvangar Cave cleared. So let's go back there and make our way towards... We've got to kill at least one dragon this stream, right? <clears throat> I've adopted her in my games as Rena Watt. Ah. I think she's been, for a child beggar, I think she's being a little bit choosy. Like, how about you don't look a gift horse in the mouth and you fucking, you know, someone wants to adopt you, don't turn your nose up at it. You're careless enough to lose your mother in the first place. All right. Am I on the right side of the river? Yes, this is good. Keens Grove, we're heading to. See you later, Steve. Steve Scodes is off. Stephen Scods. Cracks in the ground. A weird ominous hissing noise. Can only mean one thing. But I don't know what it means. Is this a dragon burial ground? Like a weird hole in the floor. I'm stuck in a bloody wall. I'm the Dragonborn, I'm the Dover Keen. Wolves can't stop me. Kingsgrove discovered. Wrong. What? Where are you, Delphine? Oh. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking. Yeah. Where's the dragon? It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound. I'm gonna get up. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find don't out. Don't worry, Idra, I'm gonna get up. We might be too late. Oh, hi, Delphine. You can help me fuck up a dragon. And kick some dragon ass. Oh, shit. Ooh. Oh, fuck. There it is. Look at that big bastard. I'll do it. See what it does. Well, are we supposed to be sneaky? I'm doing the crouch walk as well behind Delphine. I think that dragon, I think that dragon knows we're here. Maybe, maybe not. Salukundir, Zil Guru Dova Ulsa. What? Steady. I know what's happening. Let's watch and wait. This is worse than I thought. Oh shit! Oh shit! That big dragon just brought back alive another dragon! That dragon speaks! Uh-oh. You do not even know our tongue, do you? Such arrogance. Oh, he spotted me. Take for yourself. Uh-oh. The name of Dova. Sarukanir. Kridar Chur. Mate, I'm gonna fuck up your Hold on. Oh, fuck up your dragon, you friend. Level up! Spam some... Spam some perks. Which ones am I going to use? Oh dear. I'm going to have to torch its butthole. Come 
I'm back here. Rob, you fucking bird. Stop that. Uh, potion of destruction. Destruction spells are twenty percent stronger. Where is it? Where is it? I've only got 20 seconds. Land! My voice has been silent. Hey. Yeah. yeah, you run, you fool. Where's Delphine? Is she My dead? Working out too well for me. Where are you, Delphine? Do with some whoa shit. Some help, Delphine. Ow! Fuck. Delphine's back. That time you quit hid hiding. This needs to recharge quicker. Uh, fucking smithing. Jesus Christ. Requires 60, requires 30. Oh, oh, what a shame. I can't level up my smithing. Uh. Hey, Aya. Alright, what else instead of smithing has been suggested? Not just smithing. Let's see if I can do destruction then. Ooh. What the fuck? God, this is an annoying skill tree. Uh, requires 30. I could do shock spells? 25. Fire spells do 25% more damage. There we go. Where are you, Snorkelschneer? Oh, didn't have to wait too long for him to turn up. Wait, is he fucking off? No. It's to be a real fight. Fell down a bit there, didn't you, mate? Burn you, dragon face! Wow, 
Well, like, there was not much warning there. It was just... <laughs> Fuck. I pretty... I think I've got to go quite far back now. But... Annoying. Oh, FFS. <clears throat> Where am I? Oh God, I'm all the what? All the way here? Oh Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! Did it? Like, has it even saved me going to the temple? How can I tell? How can I tell what bad effects, active effects? Gift of charity. So yeah, it's saved after going into the temple at least. Fuck's sake, that's annoying. <clears throat> Hello, Ike. Mm -hmm. Alright, we've done that. Right, we're going this way. Again, deja vu. I've got to kill this dragon before the end of the stream, at least. At least. Crunch, 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 crunch. Can't believe that dragon's bringing other dragons back to life again. What's up with that? Crazy dragons. Four minutes till home time. You be says magical Midge. Oh, I'm glad I could keep you uh, entertained while you're not at home. <laughs> you. Black. Wait, something's wrong. No, you don't want to go up there. I do. A dragon, it's attacking. I don't want to have to go up there again for a second time, but I need to now because I'm going back first time. Um, it flew yeah, shut up. I don't Take know care. what it's doing up there, but I'm not Hurry. waiting Let's for go. Like to Let's go. Let's go, Delphine. Let's do this, Delphine. Ian's a kajit? Question mark, exclamation mark, says Irina. I am. Well, that is what the viewers doth put on me. My game it's all about archery and sneaks as still life. It's kind of how I played Fallout in the end, Fallout 4, on the streams. Let's watch and wait. This is worse than I thought. 
smithing is totally worth it for a mage. Heavy enchanted armor for the win, says Lasses. How do I make that? You do not even know our tongue, do you? Nope, don't care either. Such arrogance. Your tongue is rubbish. To dare take for yourself the name of Dova. Dova. Sarukanir, Kredar, Chur. Did you hear that? Nope. They're having a fight with a mammoth and some giants. <laughs> they just decked half of its energy. That's amazing. Keep fighting those guys. Holy shit. Cheers, giants. And mammoths. I don't know how that happened, but... There we go. Nice work, guys. <laughs> that made that incredibly easy for me. Excellent work. There we go. Got a dragon soul absorbed. Did did did. Level enchanting and smithing and enchanting. Sweet. What a I stroke of luck. Answers, yes, you do. I owe you some answers. Yes, you do. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. Uh, who are you and what do you want with me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were dragon slayers, and we served the Dragonborn. Oh. The greatest dragon slayer. The Dragonborn. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor. The blades have been searching for a purpose. Well, you found now one. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. Say what? Uh, what's our next move? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Uh, who are the Thalmor? The I faction know. that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years oh, ago. Oh, those guys. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. Is that for the dragons? The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. Oh. What makes you think the Thalmor are bringing dragons back? Nothing solid yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. Oh. The Empire is weakened. Oh no. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? So we need to find out what the Thalmor know about the dragons. Any ideas? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Oh, lol. So how do we get into the Thalmor Embassy? I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Okay. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. 
I shouldn't be long. Okay. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only. Gonna I'm gonna keep an eye on the sky and my eye on the pies. Delphine's secret door key edit started. Diplomatic immunity. Meet Delphine in Riverwood, huh? What's that there, though? Travel to Salt this time. What's that mission for, then? Let's go and see what that mission mark is for. I hated the Thalmord. Snooty gits, as Stephen reads. Hobbado, hobbado, hobbity da dee do. Hello, hello, there's a chicken to kill. Is this the right direction? Yeah. So let's head up this way and see what that other quest marker is before we do anything. I hope the next Skyrim game is set in a, like a sunny place. I don't like playing games that are always so grey and dark and cold. Like what? Uh, hopefully there will be a, like a nice like Skyrim holiday island that we could go to. Quite like the um, the Oblivion DLC, the uh, um, the the Shivering Isles or whatever it was, the the crazy like place. That was quite cool. Horses. Oh, oh, that's uh, that, that's me getting a boat somewhere, isn't it? No. Um, quests. Travel to that's the Dragonborn quest. Travel to Solstenheim. I've been attacked by a group of people claiming to work for someone named Murak to find out why they're trying to kill me. And so I should. I need to find out why they're trying to kill me. And so I should look for a boat in Wildhelm that they used to travel from Stolt to Solsenheim. Yeah, let's go and find out where those cultists were trying to kill me. Witcher Blood and Wine is an awesome setting. Yeah, that's like a nice, like holiday setting. I do with some of that. Oh, I'm drowning. Oh, I'm drowning. Oh, I'm like a French vineyard setting, that one, isn't it? Which of blood and wine. Hello. If you're looking for passage to Solstheim, too bad. I'm not going back there anymore. Why? It's hard to explain. I remember those people with the masks coming on board. Then, the next thing I remember, I was here, and they were gone. That's not right, losing whole days like that. I guess not, no. There's been something strange going on there for a while. But after this, I'm done. I'm done. I'm not going back to Solstein. Oh, okay then. Yes, you are. You're taking me to Solstein. Listening to me? I'm not going back there. I'll pay you double your rate. You owe me the cultist you brought me tried to kill me. People are trying to kill me. I'm not... Okay, let's try and persuade him first. All right. You have a point. Nice. Taking you back to find out who sent them is the least I can do. Besides, <clears throat> maybe you can put a stop to whatever's going on over there. I owe them a bit of payback myself. Pay you back. All right, cool. Well, I'm going to pay them back with my flaming hands right in the face. All this snow is nice as it's nearly Christmas and all, says Emma Harkham. That's very true, Emma. Christmassy, uh, well, Christmassy themed here streets. We are. This is Raven Rock. Raven Rock. I, I don't remember doing this bit again. last time I played it. The 
luck. Maybe you can figure out what's going on around here. Find some information about these. Oh, hello. I don't recognize you. I don't so recognize I you. This is your first visit to Raven Rock, Outlander. State your intention. I've come to fuck some shit up, you know what I'm saying, blood. Or I'm looking for Mirak. Mirak, I. I'm not sure. Well, I do. Just remember. Raven Rock is sovereign territory of House. Oh, Rock. this is DLC, this is, is it? Not Skyrim. While you are huh. here, you will be expected to abide by our laws. Oh. Any questions? Oh, so it's activated the DLC quite early on. Huh, well, that's interesting. That's why I've not played this then. Do you know who Mirak is? I... I'm unsure. I swear I know the name, but I cannot place it. I don't think so. I'm not... The, the name has something to do with the Earthstone, I think, but I'm not sure what. Jialan, I was starting to wonder what happened to you. Talk to Captain Jialan. Uh, oh, wow. You got some awesome armor. Splendid. Another mouth to feed. I like that. That's some good armor. I'd be wearing the shit out of that if I was playing as a tank. Citizen. Okay, well, let's have a look at the map then. So it's a smaller, smaller area. What building is that? That is Raven Rock. So I'm in Raven Rock. So I could, I guess, look in the things, but I need to go and find. I, I, I want to go and check out this shrine. These are some odd buildings. They look like uh, the um, Sydney Opera House, sort of. Sydney Hop Opera House mixed with H.R. Giger's alien designs. <clears throat> Hello. Here in his shrine. Hello. Brass little Dell. Dell. Okay. Earthstone is good. Right. Who's in charge here? That we might remember. Is it you? By night we reflect. Oh. No. You don't seem to be in quite the same state as the others. Very interesting. Indeed. May I ask what it is you're doing here? Same t-shirt I was wearing yesterday because I'm dirty. I'm looking for someone named Mirak. Mirak, Mirak. It sounds familiar, and yet I can't oh, quite I place. Oh, wait, I recall. That makes very little sense. Mirak's been dead for thousands of years. Well, I'm going to wake him up and kill him all over again. I'm not sure, but it is fascinating, isn't it? Uh, I guess it Perhaps is. Perhaps yeah. it has some relation to what's going on here. Quite unexpected. I'm afraid I can't give you any answers, but there are ruins of an ancient temple of Mirax toward the centre of the island. Sweet. If I were you, I'd look there. I shall do that, you pointy-eared uh, pointy freak show. What are these people doing? What can you tell me about Morrowind? Nice. Red Mountain dominates the island. Every now and then, ash and debris from an eruption land on our ship. Building something, clearly. And yet they don't seem to have much to say about it. Hmm. I'm very interested to find out what happens when they think. So these people are all in a trance. Building some kind of... That's that, then. Some kind of... I don't know, shrine, I guess. By night we recline. Why the hard way to climb? Right. What by day so, there's a... some kind of... I hope I'm like... 
I hope I've not come here like far too under level. I'm only like level six. So where's the? Oh, it's all. Oh, oh shit. Oh, that's quite a walk. Reach the Temple of Mirawak. Mirawak on, Mirawak off. These fellas look like a vampire Vulcan, says Emma Harkham. That was me trying to do a vampire face. This way? Looks like I can. These giant causeway style rocks. Well, here we are. Off into the wilderness. To a place where there's. X axe on the floor. And weird moaning beasts in the background. Oh. Got something here. What's this? <coughs> Buddies. Come on. That is Reavers. Ow. Okay, burn, Reaver, burn. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, not as weak as the bandits. But still. He's not. Super loving being set on fire, I guess. Ha ha! Ah, don't like me, you fucking prick. Well, this Reaver Lord is. Uh... Ow! Kind of resistant to fire. Let's eat some cheese. So much cheese. Man, I'm gonna have a sore tummy. Uh, potions. Oh, he is. He is resistant to magic. Ah, don't like me. He's on fire still. Ah, keep burning. Ow. Stop setting me on fire with your lightning sword, you prick. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh. Hello, what the fuck is that? Hmm. Perhaps I am slightly under leveled to be coming here. Oh. I think a lot of things here are resistant to fire, Ian, living on a volcano and all, so still life. Oh. The volcano. Oh. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> any questions? Yes. I I'm I don't think so. I'm not. Geolan. Northern Maine. I'm starting to wonder what happened. Ready to go. Remember. <laughs> Back off to the shrine we go in. Hello. This may be the frontier, but we've still Shut up. I'm not listening to you. Break. I'm a wizard, Harry.
Here in his shrine. Here shrine. Speak to me. You don't seem to no. be in quite the same state as the others. I don't care. Very interesting. Yeah. Now shut up. May I ask what it is? You're trying to get past this conversation, of course. Oh wait. Nerak's been dead for five minutes. Perhaps. Click, 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 I'm afraid click, I could. Click, 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 if I were you, click, 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 I'd look there. Right, thanks. Nice. Bye. Hold on. I thought so. Click, 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 click. Click, 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 click. Mr. Eon, bring me a eagle. I'm gonna burn him into the ground. Mr. Eon, burn me a dream. Ooh. What's this here? Raven Rock Mine. Nah, can't we fucking go down Raven Rock Mine? Mr. Raven, bring me a dream. I'm gonna cut you a hole in your spleen. <laughs> what? Ghost dogs. Emma Harkin says Birmingham for the win. I know Birmingham very well. Ten minutes left on the stream, my lovelies. Oh, I need a pickaxe to mine. Gone a different way. I've gone a different way, which has uh, avoided those whatever they are. <clears throat> Glad I'm finishing the stream soon, to be honest, because my butt hurts. Hello, buddy. Buddy. Oh shit. You have no business here. Maybe. We mean you no harm, but be on your way. Okay. Goodbye. I'm take. I'm. I'm. You know. I'm, I'm in no rush to get into a scrap. She seemed pretty polite. Altar of Thrond discovered. Ooh. Oh my God. Is that a heart torn out? That is a... Uh, oof, what a way to go. Oof. So the Altar of Thrond Cave. Is that where I need to be going? I don't know. No. Reach the Temple of Mirak. Dragon <laughs> For your information information teaser trailer for the Blade Runner sequel release today. So what can't they just leave these films alone? Hello? Hello, they're all making stuff. Hello? Oh hello. Hello, everybody's making stuff. Now Hello. Do we see. Our hands you must fight idle. against what is controlling. Hi. You must listen now through them. Hello, Isra. Freya. Can you hear me? You must leave this place. You there. What brings you to this place? Why are you here? Uh, DLC added into the game uh, kind of pointing me in this direction. Who are I'm you? Freya of the Skull. I am here to either save my people or avenge them. Save them from what? I am unsure. Something has taken control of most of the people of Solstein. 
It makes them forget themselves oh. and work on these horrible creations that corrupt the stones, the very land itself. My father Storm, our shaman, says Mirak has returned to Solstein, but that is impossible. This Mirak tried to have me killed. Then you and I both <clears throat> have reason to see what lies beneath us. Yes. Let us go. There is nothing more I can do here. The tree stone and my friends are beyond my health for now. Oh. We need to find a way into the temple below. I think I found a way, you know. And when the world remembers, find them. Or not. Oh, here it is. That was easy enough. What the? What are these things? Oh. Yo. Cultists. Oh my god, they're really strong. Oh. Yeah. Frey is good at killing them. I'm kind of good at toasting them slightly. Could be a bad idea going down here. I'm dressed like one of the cultists. Help me now? We should not delay. Yeah, I'm ready. We should check these rooms for supplies before heading further into the temple. That's what I was going to do. Ooh. Dead people cooking. Search burnt corpse. Ew. That smells a bit funky in there. Eleven coins. Proper little torture palace they've built themselves down here, isn't it? Search the skeleton. We've got some gold. Vigorous stamina. Oh, look at this. Here we go. Take your time. I shall follow you when you are ready. You better follow me, because you're the one that needs to do all the killing, because my combat skills are below par, thanks to everyone who made me a mage. You having a sit... You let... Actually having a sit down. What a lazy lady. Ooh, what's this? Magica... Search the chest. <clears throat> Dead people roasting over an open fire. So still life with a little Father Christmas icon next to it. It's very Christmassy, isn't it? Barbecuing people on a fire. Much Christmas. Find them. Find them. Oh, leveled up. Hey, I've only just leveled up again. Because um, the. Because that um, giant did all the. Uh, all the battling for me. Uh, last time. I didn't get to level up again today. So Back to. Search the cultist. Fire souls area. Silver side perch. Spell tone frostbite. We must be careful in these rooms. Traps can be anywhere, and there will likely be many. Traps, eh? Mirak was trying to take power here and protect himself. In the process. Well, I think now's as good a time as any to uh, to end the stream.
just before we go on a big adventure down this tunnel and I get killed loads because um, well, I've been streaming for like four hours now and my butt hurts and I'm hungry so I'm gonna go off and I'm gonna get food wrap Christmas presents and watch Die Hard and get all Christmassy so thank you very much everybody for watching this stream of Skyrim. I'll be back tomorrow during the day streaming some more I, I think well, probably do some more Skyrim. Might do some Battlefield 1 as well. But, um, I don't know for sure. You should follow me on Twitter. That will, uh, then you, you'll be able to know because I'll tweet out just before I do a streams. Uh, thank you very much everybody for watching as per usual. It's been an honour having you all watch me stream. Thanks to Robert Payne, Mike Tiger 24 tb Bosch the Bounty Hunter, Liam Salisbury, Emma Harkham, Rena Watt, Still Life, <clears throat> uh, Red Cap has been there, Stephen Reeves, and Andy Connolly as well. Uh, we also had Steve Scodes watching, he's gone off. Um, he left a while ago. Dougie was here for a bit as well, Alex Magoo as well, Liam Salisbury, Kevin Bagust. Uh, Ike, and everyone else who's been watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. You've been fun, Dabby Dulzy. Have a great night, and I'll see you back here on Platform 32 tomorrow. Goodbye. <laughs>